Hi everyone, still fighting my cold, but I found this. These are, you know, interesting lists I, I find and see what I think. Rock's 100 Most Underrated Albums. And I would love your thoughts on them too. And as always, please remember to like the video, leave a comment below and subscribe. So this is from Ultimate classic rock website. Here we go. I've never heard blow up your video by ACDC. Is it underrated? Let me know. I've never heard done with mirrors by Aerosmith. So, so far I haven't heard any of these albums. <laughs> the Elman Brothers Band. I agree. I think Bad Company's Burning Sky, it's actually my favorite burning, my favorite burning, my favorite Bad Company Elp. So yes, I agree. It is underrated. Yeah, I'd like to hear this. I've never heard Northern Lights, Southern Cross by the band. I believe I've heard Let It Be. It's certainly... I don't know. Is it? I think it's, it gets pretty good reviews overall. Um, it's a great album. I don't think it's underrated at all. If you're a Beatles fan. <clears throat> I've never heard Beck Ola by Jeff Beck. Yes, I agree. But, you know, same with Technical Ecstasy and Never Say Die. I think those are underrated. But I think Sabotage. I think most Black Sabbath fans really think it's a great album. Blue Easter Called Imaginos. I've only, I have all of their albums, but yeah, I don't know. I would have to listen to it more, but the, uh, the production isn't the greatest and I, I don't think that helps the album. <laughs> I've, I've never been a fan of Bon Jovi and I've never heard Don't Look Back by Boston. Diamond Dogs underrated. I didn't, I didn't know what it was. It's a great album. Never heard Hold Out by Jackson Brown. Panorama. Underrated. Possibly. Absolutely agree. That is my favorite Cheap Trick album. One of the great debut albums. It's probably their, their heaviest album too. If you like Cheap Trick but you've never heard this album, I highly recommend it. Never heard Chicago 7. I think I owned that on vinyl years and years ago. Is it considered underrated? I, I thought it was, uh, I thought it had pretty good reviews and it sold very well too. I agree. The Clash, Give Them Enough Rope is a great album. Very underrated. I've never heard I Can Stand a Little Rain by Joe Cocker. Yeah, didn't really follow Phil Collins' solo career. From the inside, I might have heard once or twice, but it's been many, many years. Goodbye, Cream. It, it was, I think, half live and some studio cuts. And it was a really short, short album, too. I think it was like something like 26 minutes long. But it's been a long time since I've heard it. That's weird. Who considers Buy Old Country by Credence Clearwater Revival underrated? It's a great album. Daylight again. I don't know about that one. 
burn that's that this you know once again some of this <laughs> some of these lists are a, a little silly because because i don't think deep purple's burn is considered underrated it's considered by many people to be a great deep purple album i've never heard yeah by deaf leopard or dio's or dio and his strange highways album Love Over Gold I've Never Heard. Is that underrated? Nope. See, yeah, this is stupid. Some of these. Morrison Hotel. I don't think it's considered underrated. I, I think it's considered one of The Doors' best albums. Bob Dylan, New Morning. Haven't heard that in a long time. I'm not a fan of the Eagles, but I don't think... Is Desperado underrated? Hmm. Zoom, that's a good one for viewers that have heard it to let me know. Is that a good album? I've never heard it. I know it's mainly just like a Jeff Lynne solo album. Trilogy, underrated. That is my favorite Fleetwood Mac album. I, I, yeah, I would consider it a bit underrated. Never heard Head Games by Foreigner. I wasn't into that band. The Great Peter Frampton, Wind of Change. Never heard it. Uh, Peter Gabriel Us, is that underrated? I don't know. Yeah, I disagree. I, I think, like this Genesis album, it's considered a classic by many people. It's one of their best albums. So, underrated. Grateful Dead. I won't even attempt to say what that, <laughs> the, the album title I've never heard it. Uh, I heard that on my Does This Album Suck series. And at the end I said it doesn't suck, but it was way too long and uh, kind of boring after a while. Never heard that. That's a good album. That that might be, along with All, Th all Things Must Pass, my favorite George Harrison album. Could be a little underrated, though. Never heard Red Velvet Car. Never heard... Oh, I did. Yeah, I bought... I think I bought... No, I didn't. <laughs> no, I stopped buying Billy Idol el albums by then, but... Yeah, Cradle of Love. I remember that song, but I never did buy the album. Seventh Son of a Seventh Son. I've never heard... I have that. It's not one of my favorites, though. I might need to, to listen to it more. My favorite is Volunteers. Jethro Tull, Stand Up. Underrated? Yeah, I had that on vinyl back in the day. You know, it was good. Yeah, I don't think Elton John's, this Elton John album is underrated. Journey Departure, Halford from uh, Judas Priest, Resurrection, never heard, never heard Kansas Power. Yeah, I have this, the, the remastered CD that came out a couple years ago. I like it. It's a good album, but not one of my favorite Kinks albums. Never heard Kiss Unmasked. Underrated. Yeah, I would agree. Mm, I would not agree with that. It's not one of John Lennon's best works for me. It was a bit disappointing. Never heard Leonard Skinner's Second Helping. 
totally agree. That is, along with Ram, my favorite Paul McCartney album. Yeah, that was a good album. I think that was one of the last albums by John Cougar Camp I ever bought. Yeah, underrated. Never bought Metallica's Load. Or that one by Joni Mitchell. The Birds, the Bees, and the Monkeys. Yeah, that's a good album. Yeah, I've never heard The Present by the Moody Blues. Is it underrated? Let me know. I've never heard Bead and Fleece. Ooh, Motley Crue. That's a that's a really boy, they they put a lot of thought into that album cover, didn't they? <laughs> Motorhead Bastards. I don't think there's a bad Motorhead album, is there? I've never heard Bark Bark at the Moon. I, I never really got into Ozzy's solo career. That, I agree, is underrated. Possibly my favorite Pearl Jam album. Never heard Southern Accents. Eh, not one of my favorite Pink Floyd albums, Animals. I remember hearing that probably around the time it came out. It was good. Not really into the police. I agree. Queen Jazz. That's one of my favorite Queen albums. It is underrated. Never heard Long Live Rock and Roll by Rainbow. Never heard Too Tough to Die. Underrated? I don't think. <laughs> That's one of my favorite Lou Reed albums. I don't, I don't think it's underrated. REO Speedwagon, REO2, never heard. Yeah, that's a, I don't know if it's underrated, but it's a, a good Rolling Stones album, not a great one. Rush Hemispheres, underrated? Never owned that Santana album? Nope. 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 Yeah, I could see that being underrated. That was a, a decent country album by Ringo. It was pretty good. Never heard Countdown to Ecstasy by Steely Dan. Yeah, I'd given up on Rod Stewart by then. A Night on the Town. Crystal Ball, I had that on vinyl back in the day. It was pretty good. Never heard Thunder and Lightning by Thin Lizzy or Toto Hydra or Twisted Sister Under the Blade. Mm, I don't know about, about it being underrated. Zuropa, when it came out, it was, it was kind of, it was g good. But it was also kind of disappointing. No, nope, never heard. Stevie Ray Vaughan, the Vaughn Brothers, family style, I've never heard. I don't think that's considered underrated. It's a great Velvet Underground album. The Smoker You Drink, The Player You Get, Joe Walsh. Yeah, good album. The Who by Numbers. That would be, yeah, is that one underrated? Possibly. I haven't heard it in a long time, though. Yes, Drama. Yeah, that's underrated. It's a great album. Neil Young. Lenoise. Underrated. Afterburn, yeah, that was a pretty good album. I guess, you know, how can you follow up 
Eliminator. It was such a <laughs> big selling album with so many hits. And But, you know, they gave it a good go and it's a pretty good album. And that, I believe, is it. Yeah, so let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And thank you for watching. Have a great day. Bye.